It's more important than ever to have fast, reliable internet. Upgrade your internet and switch to iFiber Communications. Gigabit internet for only $59.95. A big crowd gathered at Lacey City Hall Wednesday night to hear WashingtonBigfoot.com founder Ryan Leesinger speak about the history of Sasquatch in Washington. Leesinger, whose day job is working IT for the state of Washington, founded WashingtonBigfoot.com in 2013. He says the site's main objective is to focus on the culture, history, and importance of Bigfoot in Washington. Leesinger says Washington leads the nation in reported Bigfoot sightings. He says Bigfoot popularity and cultural impact has skyrocketed in the last few years. It's, it's, we're seeing it more and more. You see on Bigfoot in advertisements, you see Bigfoot by um, uh, city you know, transit groups are now doing Bigfoot commercials and you're just seeing it more into the culture. And um, it's ebbed and flowed throughout history. It's, there's been times when Bigfoot has been a pop culture thing and been on TV more and then it kind of disappears for a while. And this is one of those times where we're definitely seeing a, a rise in popularity. Leesinger concluded his speech with a Q&A portion allowing attendees to ask questions and share Bigfoot stories and sightings. Bigfoot enthusiast Misha Ralston says her first Bigfoot sighting occurred two years ago while camping in the Nisqually Valley. She and her husband often go on Sasquatch lookouts and travel across the state to attend Bigfoot events and gatherings. Um, my husband says he's actually had physical eye contact with one. I haven't, however, our Friday night date night is going out in the woods to listen and to um, observe and um, one night we are going to our normal spot and we went to walk in and we hear oh, 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 you know like a really monkey deep gruddler sound right where we would have been sitting like 30 yards in and we're like hmm he goes we're not going in there. <laughs> Leesinger says Bigfoot enthusiasts use his site to share sightings and plan future gatherings across the state. Those interested can visit WashingtonBigfoot.com for more information. I'm Sean Wells for iFiber One News.